Hello peeps, so we got 24 pieces of exactly the same circuitry, I believe that was some kind of uh, tracking device or something like that because it has place for a card, SIM card, yes yeah, SIM card, that's the word, SIM card and some kind of uh, GPS device on top of it and yeah, a few nice stuff, so let's just play with them there is 24 pieces exactly the same and later on we will all see what we get out of that so let me just take it all apart and then we will all see what we get out that could be interesting so see you soon hey peeps as I was playing with this I decided to go with uh, with that in the few steps anyway the first steps will be actually almost finished because this one is really finished with the first steps but anyway I got like four pieces left and I decide to take uh, crystals off brass off those tiny silver uh, and gold plated plugs off and those jumpers those are my favorite anyway and those tiny circuitry here I have some ribbon wire and just simple wire. Anyway, how the whole process is going, let me just show you at the one of it and then yeah, I will just finish it up and then we go further. So grab the circuitry, three screws going off, just like so. Then we got our small, nice, gold shiny circuitry, tiny ribbon wire. Later on, we got our uh, silver and gold plating. They used to be all gold, but this time it's silver outside. But anyway, so uh, next, two jumpers coming out three of them on each on every and every box then we got our crystals on the place and we got our brassy razors so they are going to the right box and and yes I got two tiny bits of wire in here so why not to take them out just like four screws to undo and drop it to the wire a little bit and yeah so that's the process of one of that circuitry later on I will take care about the rest because I am actually <coughs> mostly for those tiny circuitry for now for begin and anyway, got like, yeah, two more. Oh, don't flip it. Anyway, that's the process. You can all see. It's going quite quick and easy. So, see you later on. Okay, so peeps, I did go through those materials one time. As you can see, I did remove all those nice circuitry. So that will be separated and processed processed other time anyway that's what's left over on the board I removed only this board of it so I remove as well some crystals so many I get I remove jumpers because I like it I don't know why but I just really liked removing them and there is another box with them building out so let's just drop it to the collection I believe I have two or three boxes like that with those jumpers they are all a little bit gold plated anyway so I also removed those brassy razors they are quite heavy I would say yeah 50 60 grams so not too bad 
and as well I did remove those tiny plugs uh, from those antenna cables or wire all wires is in this tiny bucket what I get all cool not really a lot but you know all adds up so I just drop it to my wire basket bucket bucket basket yeah. and that will be end of the story I got some ribbon wires what I will just drop into either wires or low grade circuitry and those tiny contacts or plugs supposed to look like that I do have quite a lot of them until now but anyway this one it's silver plated at the top instead of gold but they still are still have those gold tiny pins at the center so that's all cool I will just mix them together with this one no big deal and they are just waiting for filling up the box and for further processing but it's I begin to feel some weight on that so that is good sign and yeah, what we do have left on this circuitry nothing behind uh, here in this plugs or connector supposed to be some brass but I'm not sure if I gonna go after it anyway I got one tactical switch supposed to be some silver on it but yeah I'm also not sure if I go after it we got some gold pins here here and there that the places where the jumpers was we got a uh, sim card slot or place for sim cards we got some gold plating in this tiny plugs and yeah few LEDs in here with basically visible gold on them some ICs MOSFETs those tiny four-legged bugger I'm not really sure what those are but yeah anyway we got one tiny relay in here this look like some kind of transformer and anyway I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with those either I could sell it as it is as a mid-grade and probably that's what I will go after or I remove it all totally all and then sort it out one two three four five six I see I can see some capacitors some junk but anyway yeah I believe I will just drop it into the mid grade and try to get rid of them there's not huge amount but quite nice pile and about those ones I will process further for sure because we got like a nice ICs PGAs and something under those cover quite nice uh, gold shine behind and yeah of course some gold pins in this tiny plugs in here anyway let me just try to there is those tiny plugs where those stuff come in connected anyway let me take those tiny cover out okay tops is not magnetic and what do we have under one nice gold aged crystal one two PGAs one tantalum capacitor and this I'm not really sure what is this it looks like sandwich chip because the top is dark black 
uh, base or bottom is like white so not really sure anyway so that was the tiny one and we actually can see the pins in here in this one I don't know if camera pick it up but anyway so few MLCCs yeah that could be nice material for playing with anyway so that's the result for now and I believe I end up on this stage and that will be part one so cool stuff cool piles and yeah of course our screws just iron anyway see you all guys okay okay folks so let's finish those up uh, as I said before those going directly into the uh, mid grade pile so I get rid of them because there is yeah as I said not too much materials to get rid of to clean it up totally anyway let's just quickly check out what we end up with so almost one more yeah we got almost two kilos so not too bad very cool and I believe last time was for the mid grade it comes like 15 crowns or something like that so not too bad so cool so I get like 30 crowns on that almost anyway let me just get rid of that okay so I did locate my mid grade boards box so let's just check out on weight how much we get on those one I either will process it further when I have enough amount of such a stuff and yeah I will just get rid of all components from the boards uh, process self board separately you then need to separate all those stuff as well like crystals tantalums and ICs and pins and so on anyway that's cool looking materials let's just check it out how much it weights yeah almost 200 grams so not too bad if I want to sell it I will get about 40 crowns per kilo so yeah let's say I got almost 4 crowns so not too much and I assuming this is good material but the weight go much more down because I remove those cups metal cups only from one of them so but let me just quickly check out the weight of those tiny uh, covers and drop everything on there so we've got 194 196 about one one and a half grams of that one anyway but until I decide if I gonna process it or uh, sell it I have already box filled with similar stuff just like so this is all those uh, Wi-Fi wireless or Bluetooth mostly from the laptops yeah they're quite similar all of them has gold plating at the circuitry I even got some laptops graphic cards yeah anyway let's just drop it in yes this box begin to look better so and I can feel the weight so at all 
almost two kilos of that stuff. 188, 1888, anyway. So, either I can always just drop it into high grade or process it further myself. Anyway, so that will be end of those uh, scrapping uh, circuit boards. And yeah, I will find some other stuff to make video on. I'm up to sorting some circuitry. And anyway, see you all guys soon on the next one. Take care.